hi guys welcome or welcome back to my channel today we're going to be talking about my updated jewelry and i thought it'd be fun to do this because i have some new pieces that i'm going to get to incorporate into my ear piercing but let's start with what i already have on also sorry if the lighting gets like a little weird or changes i'm just filming in front of a window we're gonna start with what i'm wearing so as you can see i got my second and third hole done in february it's been healing really really well i have these like flat back earrings they're great and then i have this solid gold hoop earring in the front here when I don't feel like changing out my jewelry every day I just always keep these in and they're great it looks the same on this side um, both sides I think I am gonna have match but I don't know maybe I'll switch it up we'll see you've seen these a million times if you've watched any of my jewelry collections but this first bottom one here is a solid gold N that is for my son Noah and I've had it on since he was a week old and I have not taken it off. He is now a year and three months. And then this is from an Etsy shop. It's just a little diamond that I wore on my wedding day. I have taken it off since then, um, but I just love the way that these stack like perfectly together. They're very dainty, but they both are like a beautiful cut to the chain. So they shine a lot and I love them. I don't know why I'm always out of breath when I'm filming these jewelry videos. By the way, I don't mind my hair. <laughs> Y'all, I'm a mess today, it's fine. We'll do rings next because I love my rings. So this is my wedding set. Again, you've seen it a million times if you watched one of these before. By the way, check out these bomb nails. My nail girl always pops off. She does such a good job. But this is just my wedding set. And then this, this is my favorite jewelry that I own. This small wedding love band in yellow gold was a push present from my son to myself. This gold, solid gold chain here, it's like not an actual chain. It's a solid gold piece but it looks like a chain and it's from I want to say all right and then this here this little M M stands for Macy that's my dog my golden doodle and that is from Etsy as well and then this stack is pretty new I just got this piece from I think Sarah Elizabeth is the name I'll look then uh, it's an actual chain solid gold and it has this little diamond here I love it super dainty very much like you can't feel it barely there and then my normal size yellow gold love ring was a 27th birthday present from me to me so that's what i have here i can't remember what website i was on the other day i think it was fair coast fine jewelry i want to say where they have this thing that tells you like based on your skin complexion these are the metal colors that are going to look the best on you so whether it's white gold rose gold or yellow gold basically for my skin tone uh it recommends that i wear silver or white gold but your girl just doesn't want to. This beaded bracelet is gold and white gold alternating beads. I got it from an Etsy shop, Bellumi, B-E-L-U-M-I. -E I'll link them down below. I love them, I've bought from them for years. I have other bracelets on the sand you'll see from them. Just a really great brand. And these two here, this gold one has started to tarnish a little bit, which is really sad, but these two I got from a permanent jewelry place close to me. Um, they're great. They just like you pick out your chain, they measure your wrist, and then they solder it on. It's really, really cool and I love it. Uh, this here is this chunkier gold one is from Ana Luisa. Really great. This is an adjustable, like it has different adjustments. So that's nice. Um, and then this little mini 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 very mini uh diamond tennis bracelet is from etsy and it's beautiful and i love it so that's this arm so these first three we'll start with these beaded ones this thick one is gold rose gold and white gold alternating this is silver or white gold um they're actually all gold filled and then this is also white gold rose gold and silver alternating i love these they're all from Balumi. And then this is another permanent bracelet from that same place. It's like a paper clip chain that has little ridges on it. I really love that. And then lastly, I have a little diamond N, again, for my son Noah. Love this one so much. This is also from Sarah Elizabeth, which you're going to see some of the earrings I got are from there as well. I'm so excited for the earrings. I can't wait to change these out and like totally make them my own. So with that said, we'll get into the little unboxing. We're going to start with Sarah Elizabeth. They have the cutest packaging. I'm not going to show it all to you because I would be here all day, but this little magnetic pouch 
is adorable and like perfect for traveling. All right, I really hope these are in focus, but basically it's like three little diamonds in a little triangle style cluster. See, they look small, but when you compare them to where they're gonna be, which is in this third hole, it's gonna be literally the perfect size. I am so excited. And then in the second hole, I went for one of my favorite jewelry brands, which is Faircoast Fine Jewelry. I love them. They also have, oh, I forgot I had other hoops in here. They have the best packaging. These hoops, by the way, which I love to wear when I'm not wearing my small dainty ones, are from H&M. They're great. They're very lightweight. Um, they don't like pull your ears down at all, and I think they're perfect for vacations. So basically, it's a diamond stud, and then it has this chain. And the chain actually connects to the back of the earring. So what I'm going to do is put the stud in the second hole and use the back of this stud to back the third hole. Does that make sense? And then I'm going to use what would back the third hole in the second hole. So that way the chain kind of goes from like here and it'll go up a little bit. I just think that's going to give it a little bit of a different edge. And then lastly, this is so random, but I, I just had to show you because it feels like jewelry. Look at these clips that I found on Poshmark. So as you all probably know i am so into celine right now and this is like the celine triumph so that is my little updated jewelry at the moment these are the pieces i've just been wearing every single day if you enjoyed this video please go ahead give it a thumbs up subscribe so you don't miss out on the next one and until next time hopefully my ears will be different when you see them next bye